Hello, my name is Max from Ainsdale Prestige Automotive, and I've got a video today for you of this Volkswagen Golf uh, 65 plate car. So, from 2015, uh, it has got uh, 59,000 miles on it, there or thereabouts. So, nice condition, reasonable mileage, that's probably what you'd expect 10,000 to 12,000 a year. Six years old now, so bang on the miles that you'd want it to be. Looks in good nick, so let's have a little look around the bodywork first of all, and then have a look at the interior as well. So to the front then, um, a couple of minor stone chips on the front, as you'd expect. Uh, we will get those sorted out for you. There's one sort of section of them on the bumper there. Not sure if the video will pick it up, but we'll definitely get that sorted. And there's some minor ones on the bonnet as well. So I'm gonna drop the camera then. Uh, so we'll sort that out. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Certainly though, no signs of any scuffs or scrapes, which you really wanna watch out for on front bumpers. Gives you an indication of how good the driver's been. But very good in this case. Uh, front alloy, nice and clean, no real problems on that. All good. Coming down the bodywork then, looks good. No signs of any dents, no signs of any uh, scuffs or scrapes. Again, you want to watch out for dents in the doors, uh, scratches on it, things like that. Normally, stuff around the handle, there's nothing more than you'd expect around there. Uh, marks on here again all good for those so nice condition there back door same story all good rear wheel nice condition coming around the rear then you can see the back bumper again no signs of any scuffs or scratches on that which is good nice and clean the other place for wear and tear that you see is the boot sill um, and there are minor scuffs and scratches on it but nothing major at all nothing through the paint nothing serious so probably just give that a bit of a buff um, and I think that should be okay but there really isn't anything major on there and then in the boot as well no condition issues either so all nice and clean around the back coming down the passenger side then Same story. No signs of any dents or marks around there. Alloy, good condition. Minor scratches on them, minor ones, but no uh, no sort of, nothing big. Nothing that you have a problem with, nothing that you want to refurb. Maybe some tiny, tiny scuffs around the very edges, but uh, that's all okay. Nice and clean on the doors there, no signs of any dents. Just caught two little dents in the bonnet, um, just in the uh, just in the light coming that way. Didn't see them from the front, um, so obviously we'll have to get those pulled out. No, no major problem. And then that front alloy again, nice and clean. So really nothing on the wheels. Two dents on the front there. A couple of stone chips are touching at the front, uh, but we will sort that out. Like to do these videos before we actually do the the full prep on them truth be told just so people can see what the condition is like when we actually get them all these places will show you all the things and you know they might have repaired you know untold amounts of it um but no this seems to have been a good car well looked after uh, i believe it's got history with it as well so all good on that one uh, let's have a look at the interior all right then so starting in the back um we've got the nice easily accessible isofix point which is very very good if you've got small children um, you've got the two-tone cloth seats, so they're all okay. Um, probably just need to give them a good valet and just clean them through. There's a couple of minor marks there, probably from children. Otherwise, though, nice and clean. Let's have a look in the front. Okay, then, so moving into the front, you can see condition-wise everything very nice. Where are we there? 53,913 miles, that says. I think I said 59 before, so saved a couple of miles there. Good condition in the armrest, gear select. You've got the parking brake there. A couple of cup holders tucked away. Aircon controls, and then your infotainment screen there. Bluetooth, obviously, you can connect your uh, phone up and whatnot. 
do have a USB tucked away down there as well and an aux cable for charging. Well, the USB for charging, the aux for the audio. Light controls down there, wiper controls, indicator controls, uh, steering wheel, nice condition, flat bottom wheel, uh, no signs of any wear on that, no signs of any wear and tear on anything like that either. Um, again, they've got the two-tone cloth seats. And again, I think they just want a uh, a little bit of a scrub, just general marks. Nothing too mad with no major stains on it. Just probably want a little freshen up. There's this magic seat stuff that we use. Um, and it does it just because the actual material on the base is lighter, isn't it? So always worth just making sure it's as good a condition as possible but generally speaking inside light coloured headlining no bad smells in the car not been a smoker's car certainly no signs of any major wear on anything no rips or tears to any of the seats no fade or damage to any of the buttons or controls um no scratches or marks on the dash so absolutely yeah yeah can't fault that inside all good Okay then, so hopefully that's given you a better idea of the Volkswagen Golf that we've got for sale here at Ainstar Prestige Automotive. Um, I say I've got the mileage slightly wrong at the start of the video, it's actually done 53,000, which is better than I said at 59. Uh, because we're an RAC approved dealer, as you can see there, the vehicle will come with a minimum of six month RAC warranty. Um, there are various options to extend and upgrade that coverage on the basis of the uh, checks that we do on the vehicle. We can put a number of different warranty options on that, so do ask us about those. Always good to have a bit of extra peace of mind. Uh, we do offer finance and we will accept part exchange, so any questions whatsoever, please do give us a call. The number is 01704 829977. That's 01704 829977. Thank you.